Hello everybody. Today I'm going to be your art teachers for one day. Well, I'm not really have art talented and I don't really good with drawing Wu because Wu we have to care about perspective. Since I was young, since I was three or four years old, I start drawing human's body and after that my dad taught me about anatomy and it's really helped my drawing. I see so many artists create their characters, but their characters are not concerned to human's ratio. Well, anatomy can help that. Okay, now let go. Let's go to the class. I'm sorry. Okay, there you go. Well, I start my uh, well. I I draw my characters both in computers and in paper, but. I'm really good with drawing paper, so we're gonna do that. Okay, let's start the classroom. My little student. Anatomy. So many people really don't, uh, they don't realize about anatomy and they don't really care about it. So that's the reason why their their head is a bit strange for human body. You see the shins is over here, your nose is here, your mouth it's here. That is kind of strange. And that doesn't concern to human bodies or anatomy at all. This is really strange, you see. Your shin, but your mouth is over here. That's crazy. That it doesn't concern to human's body after all. So, the truth is, uh, Head. We start from the head. Head. We start from circle. After that, you're drawing a T cell. It's gonna be uh the ones on vertical side. It's gonna be sim the semest semestry lines for uh both right sides and left side. I mean, yeah, right side and left side. I'm sorry. And after that, your shin's gonna be about over here. And we connect your shin and your head. The circle thing is going to be your head. And T-zones on the horizontal side is going to be your guide to drawing your eyes. Your eyes latch, whatever. So your eye is going to be over here, about over here, right? And then your nose, your mouth, your eyes, human eyes, human eyes is in the sphere shape, you see, sphere shape, and then muscles and whatever. So, but then you've got eyes layer, right? Human's eyes layer. Some kind of things like this. Going out like this. Human's eye glow will be circle. As you see. So many people drawing, drawing human's eye glow like this. It's, it's not circle. But instead. It's, it's awful. Well we can use this awful just only in... In anime, you can use that, but heck yeah, you can use it too because this is anime character's class. It's not, it's not drawing class. I'm sorry for the introduction. <laughs> so as you see, 
human's eye is gonna be circle like this. In this part, you can add some eyes layer over here, and just on right on top of your eyes. And on on top of eyes layer, you can add some kind of eyes bro, like this. This is eyes bro. Well, we do have eyes latch. Human's eyes latch gonna be in shape just like you see. A bit upward for the nose. Truth is, human's nose coming. Uh, we start human's nose from a uh, three circle. And we're drawing some lines here, as you see. But then, after we take that three circle out, we've got two lines a bit very uh, horizontal. But as you see. But then, why do we see many people create their characters, but their nose gonna be like one dot like this? Well, this one dot coming from the shadow that just happened to your nose, because after you got this three circle here, the shadow will shading here. You see, a shadow, and this is the line of the shadow. It's gonna be your nose instead. You've got the nose like this. That that is the reason why why so many people drawing nose just only one dot like this. Okay. Going lower, we've got mouth. Why people drawing mouth like this? Why there's a space over here? Well, some of people. Some of people got a mouth a bit sharp on on the middle. You see the mouth. Their lip. Their upper lip is a bit sh like sharp. So sometimes when the light comes through this sharp lips, the lips is gone. That is the reason why people have uh, uh, erased or having some space on their, their mouth, you see. There is so many ways to create your anime's character. Yeah. Now, this is this is anatomy for face. Just for face. And after that, your neck will connect to your face as you see. Your neck will have a bit of line that connects to your collarbones. Sometimes you don't have to really drawing it. This is collarbones, right? This is gonna be your collarbone. Your ears will be a bit lower than your eyes. Some people drawing ears a bit big like this. And so many details shown out. Well, the truth is human ears uh, doesn't, doesn't uh, appear like this. We don't really see every details of human ears. So, like this instead.
There's gotta be your humans here, right? This is your lip. So this is how we're drawing humans and use anatomies to help your drawing. This is anatom anatomies for your face. Okay. Let's go a bit, uh, let's step to another thing instead. Let's go to human's body anatomy. Just body, huh? Human bodies will start from uh, the just the bodies. Humans bodies start from one square, one circle, and one another one square. You see. Why do we have to draw a circle over here? Because circle will help you to find your uh, your ribs. You have to start from drawing a symmetrical lines. As you see, these symmetrical lines will help you a lot with drawing. And you can connect these symmetrical lines to the, the upper square you see before. And this is going to be your rib. This circle thing is going to be a space between your tummy. And after that, draw some kind of things. Uh, this is going to be your, your, your things. Whatever. I, I don't know how to call it. And this is going to be your butt. So, draw another, draw another, draw another squares over here. And you will got some kind of things like petrol muscles. This is man anatomy. And after that, you can draw some rips. Just some of it, just some of your ribs were shown on your side. This is going to be his tail over here. As you see. And after that, draw another, draw another squares, but a bit strange one. About six, six of them. This six square is going to be your six pack. Well, some of men don't have it. I, I, I'm I'm one of them. This is gonna be your collarbones, and this is gonna be your neck. Your pee pee is gonna be over here. Your butt. Man's butt will be a bit sharper than a uh, woman's butt. Your things. It's gonna be over here. Indeed. Okay. This gotta be your shoulder. Your upper arms. Just imagine about the cylinder. You see? Same shape of it.
this is gonna be your elbow and this gonna be your lower arms and after that your hand well it's kind of hard for beginners to drawing hand well I'm one of them I don't really good with drawing hand and now I'm start doing it this is gonna be men's body okay let's go to women's body women's body the ribs will be a bit smaller than the hips instead the hips will be a bit bigger so your squares on your hips gotta be a bit bigger than how you draw into the men okay well i'm just about to start drawing women's so i'm so sorry if it was not really good so as always drawing symmetrical lines this is gonna be her tilt this is gonna be her tilt women's don't really have a pectoral muscle so you don't have to draw it and again her tilt okay and this gotta be her color bone her ribs gotta be over here women's don't really have six pack so you don't really have to draw this six uh this six squares over here i don't know what shape of it i don't know what do we call this and they But it's got to be four instead. Her pee pee is going to be. Um, no, she don't have pee pee. I don't know. I don't know what to call it. I'm sorry. Okay. Her hips got to be over here. And again, it's got to be a bit bigger than men's, men's hip. Uh. Well, some of beginners don't know that they can erase the thing if it's gone wrong. So you can erase sometimes. Her shoulder. Upper arms and lower arms. As you see. This is human's anatomy. Well, I'm not really good with it, but this is all I can tell for beginner. Maybe I should choose another topic indeed. I should choose a topic like singing a song. What the hell? This topic is the worst I can review. I forgot to find a vocabulary about human body, so I'm really sorry about this. Uh, and my work is a bit messy, so I'm so sorry if some of you guys don't really understand what I'm saying or what the hell did I just talking about. So that is the end of the video. Thank you.